I recently started my new job as a doctor at the Brookhaven Hospital. I was so excited to start. But on my first day, I had a patient who came in not feeling well. I did all of the normal tests on him and everything came back normal. Eventually, he told me he felt better after he had talked to me. But now, he's come back to the hospital every day saying he's sick and he only wants to be seen by me. Today, I decided I'm going to get to the bottom of it. Oh, oh my gosh, I see. Someone is needing me at the front desk. Oh, okay. Um, everything okay here? Oh, oh my gosh. Hi, it's him. Uh, this patient is requesting only you. Oh, um, hi Bert. Welcome back, okay. Um, why don't you follow me into this room behind here? Hi, Santa. Okay, let's go. Oh my gosh, this is so weird. I'm starting to get quite uncomfortable because I don't understand why he keeps coming back. All right, come on, Bert, and you can sit down on the bed or lay down, I guess. Okay, so how are you feeling today? You've been coming back, um, this is the eighth day this week. What is it that's wrong? Not too good. Oh, well, what happened this time? How can I help you? My knee hurts very bad. Oh, your knee hurts? Wait, okay, wait here. I'm gonna go get something to take a look at it. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. The amount of times he wants to be seen by me a week, how long is this gonna continue for? Okay, let me see if there is anything wrong with your knee. Okay, um, well, I don't think that there is anything. Let me, let me feel it and see. No, I mean, you're not reacting weirdly to me touching your knee. Um, are you sure that any, ev not everything is unusual? I mean, it seems fine. Reacting normal. I think I scraped my knee falling for you. Oh, okay falling for me um <clears throat> um okay well you need to be careful with that i think that you could just go to the front and the nurse will give you just some something to clean your your scab with and uh, you should be all good to go just be be careful we can't talk anymore oh i have other patients uh, waiting for me Someone having the doo-doos, and I just need to stop that. I don't want to leave yet. Ugh, fine. Yeah, okay. All right. Okay, Bert, have a good day. Oh my gosh, this is crazy. The amount of times that he comes back, it's so strange. It's day number eight since I started working here, and every since, every day since he has been here. It's super strange, and he, he scraped his knee falling for me? Ugh, I don't know what that even means. I feel like I need to find out what it is that's going on. Everything okay here? When will Santa be done working? Um, why is he asking her these questions? Uh, I can't tell you that. Uh, Bert, did you have any more questions? I think you need to leave now. Or are you good to go? Uh, uh, no. Okay, see you tomorrow. No, 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 no. Okay, all right, he's out of here. So he's coming back tomorrow. Don't you think that this is really strange? Like, what should I do about this? Ugh, it is. I mean, he literally told me he scraped his knee falling for me. Do you think he's like in love with me or something? Like, what do I do? Can I tell the police about this? Cause I'm feeling a little bit creeped out. It seems that way. Hmm, I think so. Yeah, I don't know what to do. I mean, do you think it would be wrong of me to go and follow him home to see what it is that he's up to? If he says something strange or if I find something weird in his house? Maybe not that I would go inside his house, but I could look through the windows to see what's going on. Maybe you could get to the bottom of everything. Yeah, I mean, I think I would need to. I mean, I can't just have him disturbing me at work every single day because... There's patients who come in here with real serious problems that need my attention. Just be careful. Oh, I will. You know what? I might have to stop early today just to get to the bottom of this. I'm going to go change and I'll see you tomorrow. That's fine. Bye. Okay. Oh my gosh. This is absolutely crazy. 
I'm just gonna change real quick. And I guess I'm gonna go see what it is that's going on with this patient. I do have his address because it does say on his information, his patient information. And I think it might be right up here. Oh my gosh, I see him right now. <gasps> oh my gosh, this is weird. Okay. I can see quite a lot from this window right over here. I don't even have to go inside to find out. His house is really, really big. I wonder if she likes flowers. Oh my gosh, he's holding flowers in his hand right now. Do you think that he actually loves me? I mean, I don't even know what to say to that. He, I, I find it kind of creepy that he would pretend to be sick and, and fall for me to get my attention. Maybe I'll ask her on a date tomorrow. I feel super weird about this. Oh my gosh. What if she says no? Oh my gosh, I feel bad. I think I'm gonna go home now. The other only creepy thing is that <clears throat> he is my neighbor, which is kind of creepy. But, oh well, I just need to make sure to lock the doors. Because, I don't know, it kind of creeps me out sometimes. But I need to stay professional because it is my work, it's my job. So, I can't just refuse patience. That would be awful. I think I'm just gonna go and sit and watch some TV or something, relax for the end of the day because... I feel like I've had a lot on my mind lately. Maybe I'm just going crazy because of all these work hours. Oh, oh my gosh, look at that cute cat and the cute dog. Oh, oh my gosh, do you guys see that? He's looking through my window. This is not okay, he found out where I live? How did he find out where I live? I mean, we are neighbors. So maybe that's, maybe saw me one day walking in here. How long has he been looking at me for? I'm going upstairs, this is creepy. Oh my gosh, this is so weird. Is he gone? Oh my gosh, this is so creepy. I don't like this. I don't have the biggest house either, so I feel like I don't really have that privacy. Where did he go? He's gone. <gasps> I think he's gone. Let me go look in the garden real quick. Let's see. Um, I don't think he's here. I think he must have gone home again. This is so creepy. Uh, uh... Oh my gosh, okay, he is gone. Let me just go upstairs and get some work done. I kinda need to finish some more work because I had to kind of cut work short today. Oh, oh my gosh, he's standing in the window. He's standing in the window right behind my, my, my computer right over there. Okay, um, this is not okay. This is really not okay. What do I do? Oh my gosh, and it's getting dark now too and he was out there creeping in my window. Okay, he's gone now. Okay, let me just close all my curtains real quick. There we go. And I think I'm just gonna head to sleep and, I don't know, get to work tomorrow. I don't know, I really do not like this. All right, guys, good night. I'm gonna see you all tomorrow. The next morning. Oh, oh my gosh, I never get used to waking up early. That's awful. Okay, well, I haven't heard anything strange tonight, which is really good. I'm gonna go take a shower and get ready for work. I need to be at work early this morning. All right, perfect. Let me brush my teeth real quick. Perfect, and wash my hands. All right, perfect. Now I just need to get changed. All right, I'm good to go. Okay, I guess I'm just gonna keep the curtains closed and I'm gonna turn the fire off. All right, I think I'm good to go. I'm just gonna lock my door. And let's let's head to work. Oh my gosh, I hate walking past this house every single morning. It's creeping me out, especially after he was looking at me all day yesterday. I don't know, I don't like this. All right, let's go to the hospital. Oh, hello, you're already here. Good morning. Well, let me actually keep you updated with what happened. So I decided to go to his house and it didn't seem that anything too wrong was going on at his house, he was saying that he was gonna ask something, like to go on a date. I don't know, I'm really hoping he's not talking about me, but I think it is. How odd. But then I went home and I went to sit down and watch TV and he was looking at me through the window. And then I went upstairs to get some work done and he was there again. He climbed up on my roof to look at me through my window. I mean, who does that? That is crazy. I know, it's crazy. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe it. I'm just honestly waiting for him to come by here this morning because he said he was gonna ask me on a date this morning. So 
Yeah, let me know if something strange happens, okay? I'm just gonna go down and get to work. Oh my gosh. I can't believe it. Absolutely crazy. Two hours later. Oh, well, look at that. I just got a message. I am needed at the front desk. Okay, let's see. Do you think it's him? Probably him. All right, I'm here. Oh, hello, uh, Bert. <laughs> oh my gosh, he brought the flowers. Oh no. <sighs> Why'd you call Santa? Uh, wait. I'm not needed here? Uh, don't you always ask for her? It doesn't matter. Oh, okay. So is nothing's wrong? You're not hurt or anything? Anyways, uh, will you go out with me? Wait, he's asking her on a date. Uh, me? Um, what? But I thought you liked Santa. Uh, that's what I kind of thought, too. What is going on here? No, I'm just really shy. Oh. Oh, my gosh, what? So he really doesn't have a crush on me? So why was he outside my windows last night? Why is he looking at me all the time? And I thought she could help me get close to you. What? He just tried to use me to get close to her. Oh, my gosh, this is crazy. I got it all wrong. Really? These are for you. Oh, my gosh. He got her flowers. <gasps> what? Thank you. So, what do you think? I, I would love to. <gasps> oh my gosh. She would love to. Wait, what? <gasps> oh my gosh. She just picked him up. Uh, is, is everything okay here? Are you good to take my shift, Santa? Well, I, I, I guess so. Thanks. Bye. Bye, Santa. Thanks for the help. Oh, uh, you're welcome. Bye. Oh my gosh, they're like running into the sunset together. Happily ever after. Oh my gosh, I really did not believe this. This is so strange. This is crazy. Did you guys really think that this was about to happen? That this is how the story would end? All right, guys. Well, thank you so much for watching this video. Really hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to leave a thumbs up on this video for more Brickhaven videos. And make sure to use star code I am Santa if you're buying Robux. I'm going to see you soon with another video. Bye.